What do you have here? What did we do today? Mommy do my hair. I wash tablets. I don't know if I have it. It's the way, but it's the way. What? Slow down. What happened today? What What did we do today? Mommy finished my hair. It was beautiful. It rainbows. Today I wash my table today. Play the game. Today. Six and a half hours later. My hair looked beautiful. Then I went to go back to school. So, let's show them your hairstyle for school tomorrow. <laughs> it's so cute, Amory. It's so cute, Amory. <laughs> okay, what else you want to say? I go say, hey guys, welcome to my show. We're here in Mommy's living room, so. <laughs> We're here in Mommy's living room. This is Mommy's beauty room. Because that my fish right here and started to rain a little bit. It started to rain a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it's getting white to the beach. Hey y'all, welcome back. So this starting off, I'm just showing you guys her afro. Y'all know we natural over here, okay? Um, I will be showing you guys all the products. The first product is the Cantu Argan Oil Leave-In Conditioner repair cream i love this stuff i'm showing you guys the bb super grow the spectrum organic version coconut oil the eco salad gel and i will be showing you guys the sleek and shine gun your fruities anti-free serum showing you guys wide tooth comb and regular comb and like an edge brush and also don't forget that edge control okay so just starting off, you guys, I had went ahead and did section off her hair. I parted it in half, and then I parted the first section, the top section, into three sections. It's not straight. I will be straightening the parts as I go. I will be starting off in the middle of her head because I wanted a braid to be, like, directly smack in the middle, okay? But, um, yeah, that's pretty much how I parted out the hair. I'm just putting on the conditioner right now, you guys, because I had just finished uh, washing her hair and I just let it air dry. And I did not put any leave-in into it. And so, yeah, that's why I'm going to be putting all the moisture and grease in the scalp and all of that good stuff. So, I just decided to show you guys the product. If you guys have watched previous videos with me doing my daughter's hair, y'all know that I always show you guys the products. And y'all also know that she's natural. And y'all also know that I do not try to get these parts super straight. I try to get them the best way that I can because my kids like to do what they want to do. Okay. They like to just sit there and be on their tablet and be all into it and not holding their head correctly and all this stuff. So I just get the best way to where it looks decent. Okay. And you know, I don't be trying to strain them. However, I just went ahead and did like a little bang and I just showed you guys that and I will be doing another one. I'm going to do like two little twists for her bangs and then we're going to go ahead and get into that braid. I am a person that braids under, I believe that's what it's called, like an underhand braider, whatever. So that's why you guys see me braiding the way I do braid. But this is the best way for me. I'm showing you guys right here is where the twist starts. I started off with like a regular braid, like a regular cornrow braid, whatever. And then like once I get to the part that's not on the scalp, like the leave out, not the leave out. Once I get to the part that's like the hang time, that's what it's called. Once I get to the hang time, I just split the two to where they're even. I split the three, you know, from the braid into two. And then I just begin to do like a two-stranded twist. Okay, you guys. And I'm just going to show you guys that once again so you guys can see like what exactly I'm talking about. And showing you guys like the part that I sectioned off, I had this begin to do like a regular braid. Once I get to the part where it's like hang time or whatever, that's when I like split the three into two and I just begin to like do a two strand twist 
on that and then it'll come out looking like this if you decide to do yours like how i'm doing hers so yeah that's pretty much it you guys i'm gonna go off and come right back with the top portion i already finished and then yeah you guys gonna see it now i had went ahead and just added the beads you guys off camera you guys can tell the side braids are not braided i had decided to show you guys like how i'm gonna be doing these um i'm not gonna be braiding them straight back i'm gonna be doing them in reverse like i'm gonna be braiding them forward like to the front of her face um i'm not gonna be doing them like how i did the other ones you guys i'm going to just be braiding it forward um i believe i showed you guys in the last tutorial which i will link down below for you guys who want to check that one out um how i did them and so yeah that's pretty much what i'm going to be doing to this braid on this side and also the one on the opposite side and then i'm gonna show you guys that so as you guys can tell the braids are coming forward they're not like the ones we did previous before these i'm going to go ahead into the back section and i'm going to show you guys how i'm going to be parting that out and i also will i already have this section already greased you guys so yeah um the parts are not super straight like i said before i'm just going to go ahead and just do it like that and i do clean up the parts you know as i'm working like you know what i'm saying i just try to get like a feel of it and then i go back and clean them up the best way okay so yeah that's pretty much how i'm going to be doing it like how i did the first ones just braiding them straight down and doing a twist at the end and then i'm going to be adding the beads you guys um nothing very dramatic you know what i'm saying this style is like very quick very easy to do you guys so please excuse my heater i'm gonna have to talk a little bit louder but this style is very easy you guys to do um i'm gonna come right back and show you guys how it ended up coming out i just finished the back row and then we're gonna get into that last section and we're gonna pretty much do the same thing we did you know all over the whole head the braid do the twist at the end and then your girl gonna come back like y'all can really do this style it is a protective style like like, it'll last her for like a week or two you know what i'm saying and yeah you know what i'm saying it's pretty easy to do y'all can do it y'all can try follow directions and y'all get it period nah <laughs> guys i just went ahead and finished the rest off camera and added the beads um i'm just showing you guys what it is um one product that i forgot to mention that i do use whenever i do any type of braids or twists you guys is this wrap setting lotion from cream of nature their argan oil kind and um yeah i just love this it likes sets the braids in place make them last longer and keep them fresh looking i also will be going in with this sleek and shine and i would just be rubbing it in my hands and then applying it to the hair as well you know what i'm saying massaging it in with that wrap setting lotion and it keeps the frizz away you guys like no cap like it really does work and i also will be taking this eco styler gel and i will be applying that to that girl edges period and we're just gonna lay them edges down lay it down lay it down now nah, but we're just gonna lay the edges down you guys and yeah this is pretty much how this style came out y'all and i will be like putting a scarf on her head so we can really lay them edges down because yeah we gotta really do it because her hair will like curl up i really like this eco salad gel because it says it's for curling wave i believe all of them do the pretty much the same thing but this one in particular it really does define the curls and work really good for people with curly hair and wavy hair like it really does because she has like curly hair and wavy hair like mixed okay it might not look like it at first but baby yes this girl has some good really good hair okay and uh <laughs> yeah we're just gonna wait five minutes and then we're gonna come back okay so boom we're back i'm just gonna go ahead and untie this wrap on her head and as y'all can see them edges are laid period emory is so goofy she thinks she cute and she is period <laughs> Here's 
you dare. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Love you. Good job. This elf pencil in the shade dark brown and it is one of their eyebrow pencils i'm just going to lightly fill in my brows this product